Hey everyone, it's Goss, and today we're gonna get kinky because we're gonna talk about sex myths that straight people think about gay sex. Are you ready? Let's go! Myth number one. Gay people, especially men, have multiple partners. Many single people have multiple partners, but I know many relationships that are not even open. They're traditional monogamous relationships, so that's a major misconception. Myth number two. All gay men love anal sex. Do they? I mean, there's a correlation that gay men is anal sex, and it's exactly the same thing, but it's not. Actually, it's not. Many people, especially in couples, they don't really like anal sex or they don't do it much often as you think they do. There's always a top and a bottom in a relationship. You know, especially in relationships, people used to experiment with each other, they try everything. Many people do have strict roles, like top and bottom, but many and trust me, many relationships do both, because they can. Gay sex is always kinky. Gay sex can get boring so fast. We need to make it kinky sometimes, but gay sex can be boring. It's not kinky at all. Like straight sex can be kinky, and straight sex can be boring. Same thing, gay men only think about sex. <laughs> Maybe that's true. Nah, we've got lives, you know. Like, women believe that straight men only think about sex. And straight men believe that women never think about sex. Myths, 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 myths. You can tell who's the top and who's the bottom by their looks. You can never, never guess who's the top and who's the bottom in a relationship. On generally in life, who's the top and who's the bottom. Because you can see many masculine guys being bottoms and many feminine guys being tops. Because straight people, and correct me if I'm wrong, believe that feminine guys are always bottoms and masculine guys are always tops. Nah. In a gay relationship, people believe that there's always one feminine guy and one masculine guy because that's how you can compare it with a heterosexual relationship and you make the masculine guy being the man and the feminine guy being the woman but that's totally bullshit 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 in a gay relationship both of them can be feminine both of them can be masculine. Many relationships are masculine and feminine. It's just two men. There's not a woman. Stop trying to find the woman. So that's it for today. Let me know in the comments down below what straight people told you, what weird misconceptions they had, or if you're straight, what do you think about gay people that may be a myth? Or if you thought about any of those myths that I talked about seconds ago. If you liked this video, click the like button, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe down below, new video every Sunday, but for now, bye bye.